Hello everybody, Paul Jancarella here from Speaking to Empower. And I wanted to share a message of patience with you all today. In my mindset training course, uh, it gives me various uh, scenarios and instances where we can better ourselves, our results, and our overall happiness uh, by just changing things in our minds as opposed to having to change things out there. And, and let me give you an example to that. Uh, I've been uh, pretty in tune the past few months of my volatility, my, <laughs> my patience, my impatience, should I say. And we're getting new uh, sectional couch and a new uh, bed for downstairs for when uh, guests visit. And my wife is very happy about that, that she's very pleased uh, to be getting that. But prior to getting uh, the furniture, we have to do a little bit of prep work and, and things. And it's a bit stressful, which is, which is understandable. You got to move the area rug and this table and that chair and and my wife is very, very antsy and say, you know, come on, move this, move. I said, Betty, relax. I said, you know, if, if we leave it this way, we'll be fine. She's like, yeah, well, what if it doesn't fit with this chair right here? I said, Betty, you wait tables a couple nights a week. Has anybody ever come in and ordered a dish and didn't like it and wanted something else? She's like, yeah, all the time. I said, okay. If they set up the furniture and, and you don't like it, they can move it. You know what I mean? It's not the end of the world, especially if we're nice and, and loving in a certain respect and we're not bossy. And that worked perfectly. Uh, and it's working perfectly. Uh, but we have to be aware of it at all times because your impatience your aggravation, your irritability can sneak up on you in the, in the snap of a finger, speaking from experience. So in your bouts or in your venues today, think about what is something that may make you a little bit irritable and anticipate it. And when you anticipate it, it subsides much easier if, if you allow it to. Some people don't want to be patient. Some people want to be impatient and want to be ticked off and upset. Like I used to be at certain times of my life um, a few years back. That's the message for today. It will save you um, heartache and it will generate you some money, figuratively and literally speaking. In the meantime, be well, stay well. We'll talk to you soon.